Oh, why, hello there, White Fire. Hmm. I think I think you're gonna be coming with me just just for just for a quick walk. I'm gonna need you to get into the boat. So so if you could just cooperate. Yep. Awesome. But hey, everybody, welcome back to the Afterlife SMP. Today is um, I don't know I don't know what episode it is. Anyways, we're back and we are bringing White Fire somewhere somewhere. I don't know where that somewhere is. I'll be honest. <laughs> I just, I just kind of wanted to experiment with the pig and take him somewhere. And here you go. Have uh, uh, whoops. Have fun, White. <laughs> oh my gosh! Look at this. Look at him go. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> oh man, that is hilarious. And yep, that is just one of the things you do when you have an Enderman head on. I guess I'm starting like some cult, I don't know, but uh, basically if you have an Enderman head on, you can take people in random places, that's kind of what I'm doing. Anyways, thought we'd check stock on all of our shops, which is only two unfortunately, and uh, that that's a shame. Um, but also, me and GP did get a terraforming request, I was notified on Discord, so uh, we could check this out right here. Our Torvian has sent a request, and he wants us to flatten down an area we sent. he sent to us. Yeah, I guess we should go meet up with GP and get that done, uh, but first, we have, we have another request from Kyle, looks like. Okay, we'll be getting to that hopefully later today. Alright, GP, it looks like we have yet another terrific request. But this one's not so terrific. It's it's large, massive, uh, and yeah. very grindy. Uh, uh, look at this, <laughs> this area. Artorian. Yeah, Artorian put a request in for us to take out all of these trees. <laughs> How much are we being paid? Uh, twenty-five diamonds, and you, I don't, I don't remember what yours was, but I'm only getting twenty-five diamonds for this. Um, yeah. <laughs> We're, we're, we're gonna need something more than this and you know yeah. i'm not sure uh how he wants us to flatten this out but we're just gonna we're just gonna do it all right we're just gonna do some stuff around here and see how far we can go Alright, GP, well, look at all this work we've got here. Um, My goodness. Yeah, I mean, it looks small, but uh, it, it's actually a lot. Just kidding. You're if right. you look. <laughs> uh, oh, whoa. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's, it's a huge, it's a huger area. There is no more forest. Um, and, uh, yeah, if you look at my axe, I mean, I'm sure your <laughs> axe is pretty damaged, too. Oh, to the axe. but look. The axe knows where the forest went. Whew. And we are stacked on dark oak logs. Um, just a yeah. crazy amount. Um, <sighs> but yeah, GP, we did a great thing yeah. here today. Helping out our Torvian. Um, that was awfully rude of you. Here you go. So um, I guess the next step is we have to ask our Torvian what he wants. If we're flattening this or what the deal is, because we our, our initial res, our request was to flatten it right yes but to what level are we flattening it to sea level because if if we're flattening it to sea level we're gonna need a lot more than 25 diamonds this is already a lot oh. more tw than 25 diamonds that was an hour and a half more than an yeah, hour and a half <laughs> oh man that is okay anyways i'll see you later gp i got a bunch of stuff to work on my base catch you later all right, we'll catch you later. Bye. Well, that was a terrific job with GP. Uh, also, I'm I have a wandering trader head on because, well, the Enderman head it, it just it just looks a, a little a little creepy, so I don't really want to wear it all the time. Um, but then again, this kind of looks creepy too. I can't really decide. I, my cat head. I you see, I lost my helmet, so we're just gonna stick with this. Anyways, I want to work on the palace a little bit before before we do. Uh, come on, words. I I actually got this. Uh, here it is. Yeah. So I helped Puffing Fish and sponge up his ocean monument, and he gave me a nice 
thing, a nice thing. So we can add that to our total diamonds and you give me some spruce logs, just, you know, some useful things that we may need for this behemoth of a, of a build. Which, by the way, guys, if you didn't know what this is, uh, in my update video, if you haven't seen it, you know, my computer broke, blah, blah, blah. Uh, I got a new computer, fixed it up. Well, I built it, and I think it's pretty good. Um, and, yeah, I did a lot of this off camera, so that's pretty cool, and did it all on a replay time lapse. So look at that, guys. We got lots of diamonds and extra emeralds for bricks and quartz. And, uh, yeah. Oh, speaking of quartz... I left my quartz back at the place me and GP chop trees. I'll have to go get that. One more thing I wanted to show you. I know, I did a lot of work off camera. And it looks like I had the wrong texture pack on, guys. My bad. But, if we come over here, I've been doing a lot of mining. Like, a lot. We have so much stuff. And before uh, I reveal this, don't forget to smash that like button. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, here, we got a lot of stuff. Oops, my rockets. We have a lot of diamonds, and I thought we could go ahead and mine this. 40 diamond ores. Oh, yes. Oh, this is going to be so good. And the emerald ores, I just keep them because I want to build, like, some sort of mine shaft in the future. Uh, but let, let's do this. Oh yes, that feels good. I think our bank account in diamonds is looking pretty good. And our Torvian owes us 32 diamonds, so we are really doing good uh, in the diamond department. 24 blocks of diamonds and more coming. That is looking fantastic. Okay, let me go grab my quartz and I want to get onto some building of this palace here. Oh yeah, look at my dragon chompers. Uh... Okay, I'm getting way too sidetracked with these heads. Anyways, we got our quartz. As you can see, oh, that's dark oak. Oh, that's wood. Oh, that's more dark oak. There's our quartz. <laughs> oh man, we have still we have we just have a stupid amount of dark oak now. All right, now here we are at the dirt mess, and yeah, it's 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 something else. Um, I don't even know what my plan was when I came up with this, but uh, I have a I have a better idea of what I want to do with it. And now I've made some particularly weird design choices that I'm not I'm not too sure <laughs> everybody's gonna fully agree with um, but we're gonna get to that in just a second though I want to get some of these houses in or houses these aren't houses I want to get some more of this structure of the palace in so let's enter ultra super fast doing building stuff mode yeah and uh, then I'll share with you guys my um, my, my weird design choice Alright guys, so I just came back to get a little more quartz from Mario's masonry, but there is a certain someone, or it's it's Blonde Skunk's pig, and I think I think as a part of um um the what what am I what did I call this again? The Enderman Cold or something? I don't know. We're gonna take you somewhere special. <laughs> okay, Mr. Skunk, please just hop in the boat. Um, or this is actually Blonde Pig, um, my bad. We're gonna take this the same place as Whitefire, right in a, uh, in a nice cave. I'm thinking eventually we get somewhere better for these guys to go, you know, make it a little bit more of a challenge than just a, just a plain old cave. Um, but for now, this, this cave with the flowing water works just fine. And, and, um, can, can you, can you, just, just a little more, um, please, hold on, hold on, this, 
And there we, uh, come on, come on, no, can I fly? Uh, oh gosh dang it, okay, this is a little buggy, okay, we're going, we are, yep, see you later, see you later, skunk, mm-hmm, <laughs> oh, what is this we have here, uh, best slime, eh, Project Maple, okay, I actually, uh, was considering getting back to our slime pit game in the games district, so we might need to t pay a visit to there. Um, but yeah, for now, let's head back to our palace. If you guys remember, I, I said I said I wanted to build something a little bit unusual for a palace, um, but then I thought about it. I gave it a good think, and uh, it's actually really not that unusual. I don't know what was going through my head that day. Yeah, by the way, it's a different day uh, than recording that clip, but uh, I just want to build a garden here. And, now I, and that's totally normal for a palace, I think, you know, like a palace garden. Okay, anyways, we're building a garden right here. I thought this was a great spot. Uh, you know, you got like the balcony view, you know, you got all the buildings by you. It's kind of like a wall almost. And you can see across the the land we're going to be building here, hopefully, hopefully soon. So yeah, now just going ahead and replacing all the stone with dirt and uh, then, yeah, making the garden. So anyways, let's place this dirt in and then we can get to working on the garden part of this. Okay, there we go. It's obviously, you know, not fully grown yet. Uh, but not not too bad. I think it's looking good. We got a nice space to work with um, But what I've been doing a lot more recently with my builds is trying to plan them out better <laughs> instead of just Well going in and and hoping my build turns out great, which usually they, they do You know, I'm always happy with them But I think we can do a little bit of a better job planning them out at least also I just realized this won't work because we got to put it out like that yeah, that's gonna be like a nice bench. I think that's gonna look really, really nice. And uh, we can have like a little campfire there. I'm thinking just like a garden, you know, you come out here, you know, you eat some berries off the berry bushes and you go sit down and uh, I don't know. That That's kind of the idea with this little palace garden, making it feel fancy and you know, you're on the top. And then of course, we're gonna add some cypress trees. Cypress trees just scream fancy at me. Also, we just hit 100 sleeps. Uh, if you look at the tab list, that's actually not deaths, that's sleeps. Um, if I had 100 deaths, that would be very embarrassing. Um, but anyways, yeah, that's, I guess that's pretty cool. Uh, but what do you guys think about this like planning thing? I think it's really nice just to plan things out a little bit better. Uh, hey, and there we go. I think we changed this out for spruce slabs, but that is pretty nice. Oh, yes. Uh, now, let me build these trees up, and then we can really get an overall feel for this area. All right, then, guys, I am in love with these cypress trees. They're so simple, yet they're so elegant, and I love them. Um, anyways, there's still a lot more we need to do with this area to really make it feel done. <laughs> and the first thing I'd like to do is get right on this bench, you know, uh, there needs to be a little bit more of a roof, I think, here. And we can do a nice thing if we just take some oak trap doors, right? Right across to this other side. And if we take our birch leaves, just like, just like this. And you can kind of droop them down, uh, like so. And I think this will look pretty nice when you're sitting under here and, oh, so. Like that. Yeah, that gives a nice effect. But guys, that oak thing has a little bit of a dual purpose, and I'm trying to find if we have any sweet berry bushes. Doesn't look like we have any. Anyways, let me fly back over here, but, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, we can place lanterns right there. And that gives off a little bit of lighting, which I think is going to be much needed in this area. Oh, yes, that is a very nice effect. But I actually want to go, oh, repair my axe, and go grab some sweet berry bushes. Uh, I'm surprised I don't have those. I'm very surprised. Maybe I'll double check here. Well, I was reminded there's a Taiga by Games District, but I stumbled upon this thing. And, uh, I, I don't know exactly what we can get here. Uh, prices. Oh, cool. Week number two. Looting three. 64 glass. Diamond chest plate. Oh, that is nice. Looting three. Do I have that? Ho, oh, oh, ho. These are some nice deals. Yeah, just in case I die, I'm gonna grab up one of those. I I always forget that there's this uh, little, little outpost that I think Flim Flammer moves around every week. And uh, yeah, that's pretty nice, but now we can get our berry bushes. That's why we came here. Haha, uh -huh, I'll be taking those. There we go, 42 berries, awesome. 
we got all those and now we can go finish up that garden and well actually finish up the old palace it's kind of my goal today to finish up that entire thing and here we are with the last last few okay that is nice oh yes and maybe one more there that looks good now what do you guys say let's go ahead and actually finish up this palace I meant to do it in the last time lapse but it ended up not because i ran out of time for recording that so let's go ahead and finish it Alright then guys, check that out. I think I'm at a point where I can say I'm pretty happy. I'm pretty happy with the exterior of it. Now the interior definitely needs some improvements, um, but for now it looks really great. Um, and let's add, since this is the palace of the rich, uh, I feel like we need to take our riches somewhere. Hmm, where to put these? I'm thinking right here will be a good spot, and let's just dig in here obviously. The interiors need to be done. Uh, yeah, yeah, some things need to be done, but uh, I figured we'd uh, make a nice diamond throne for us. Ah, yes, here is my seat. Oh, yes, here we are. Yeah, and we're rich. We are rich. Uh, I need some lights in here, but that is pretty nice. Oh, that's close. I feel really special. Yep, I feel special right here, Um, but, you know, it doesn't feel as special when you got this <laughs> when you got that okay uh so yeah i think i think we need to do an interior and obviously guys we are not done just yet i think what this place needs is something to do with something to fix these ugly ugly um mountains these are just not good they're they're really plain and so what i had an i had an idea what if we uh dug out little little tiny holes right just to mix it up instead of this flat slope going down um and we can grow little trees in here uh, and plants and make it nice and overgrown and kind of have like a tree poking out right there um i don't know i think that could be really fun i just don't know what tree i want to put in here hmm just kidding i do know what tree i need to put in there either these spruce trees kind of like curving out which will be a big challenge or our uh, dark oak trees and uh or the or the aspen trees i think those could be pretty nice i think we need to do a little bit of experimentation here i don't know let's find out okay okay that's pretty cool i like this i feel like this cliff is gonna look really really awesome if we kind of have like a forest literally growing out of this cliff face that's gonna look really awesome um but yeah that's a start i mean it's a, it's a start <laughs> Uh, this whole thing is a start, and oops, I don't have my volume. Also, I removed all of the chests here. Hello, I'll take that. <laughs> uh, I removed all the chests here, so we don't have a chest monster anymore. And I'm missing a block. Um, ah, much better. Anyways, guys, I really appreciate you watching today's video. I have run out of time to make this one. I got much more video to make. Yeah, I have much more video to make. I'm really great with words recently. Uh... But yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed watching me build the palace today. I think it looked, I think it turned out really, really awesome. And you know, we still need to do some things down there. Uh, you know, terraforming down here, but that, that is looking fantastic. Oh yes. Anyways guys, I'll catch you in the next video. We have some terraforming requests that need to be, that need to be done. So that'll probably be to the, the, the day's, the episode, episode's priority. I, I seriously cannot talk. <laughs> yeah, see you later.